mind a Kai campaign dwarves had 19 armies at one point. That's not even on legendary. Nice. Yeah, 19 armies is pretty normal for the dwarves. Well, it was pretty normal for the dwarves, and the dwarves got weak, and now, there's, now they're strong again. As a matter of fact, all the forces of good are ridiculously strong at this point. Like, brokenly strong. The Empire does fantastically well. The fucking... Bretonians do, like, absolutely ridiculously good in everybody's campaigns all the time. They went from being actually, like, fucking trashed here to just ruining people on the daily. Um... The dwarves are doing fantastically now because the green skins Dark suck shots. again. Masterless warriors. Masterless warriors. What changed over Bretonians? They got their their freaking re uh, rework or whatever. Talent. And they also Mother's adjusted the Bretonians so they build armies that make fucking sense. As opposed Come to just building, like, armies of peasants that turn 100 and something. Which is what they used to do. Now they build actual cav build armies. Madrasses. Which are significantly hard to deal with than peasants. Or harder to deal with than peasants. Strangely enough, go figure, right? Cold ones. Merciless warriors! Also, one of the reasons why they're so strong, honestly, is because of the, uh, the confederation changes. That's probably the biggest thing. Eager for battle. They changed the confederation options so that you're, you're guaranteed Dark confederations Elf. now as Bretonia. So the computer just battle gets ready. confederations. Nagarothi. Like, the computer just got confederations before. Like, they were... Computer was able to get confederations way easier than the human player ever was, but it actually had to like still like get it somehow. You know, like, it still had to still had to achieve the the confederation, but now it can just have it. I mean, the human player can just have it too, but it makes the Bretonians confederate together really quickly because it comes as the technology comes, and the computer gets bonuses to technology, so it just like. All of Bretonia just confederates really fast into one giant fucking death glob, goes and freaking destroys everybody around them, builds giant cav armies, and then just continues to be a giant asshole to everybody. That's Bretonia now. The confederation of Bretonia happens so damn quick now. So ridiculously strong. Now that they don't just build peasants. Jarrow Bombers, how are you? Forward. Come to be a bunch of bastards, I see. Grover Tronia, right? I wonder if I can get close to this guy. I wonder if I could do, like, old Warhammer shit. Yeah, sort of. He's not really afraid of the dragon, as long as I don't click on him. The merciless host. How are we doing over here? Executioners! I mean, as long as it's stationary, we should be able to kill with arrows relatively quickly. Executioner. See if the guy falls off the wall. That'd be funny. Very well. Understood. I would be okay with it. Hmm. Make sure I just break the door down over here. Because these towers are wildly inaccurate. The 
merciless host. Dark shards by your command. How are we doing over here? Brides of Cain. Witch elves. At Witch one. elves. Cold-blooded killers. I have Cav over here. Cold I do. One. So right out here and go shit on his artillery real quick. Because I can. Ah. How does he own this tower? I am confuzzled by that. Excuse me, pardon me, coming through. Gotta murder your artillery. It's causing me, it's causing me anxiety. Let's clear it. Black Your God. artillery does not bring me joy. Oh, is that what you're gonna do, Iron Breakers? Cold is that the way you're gonna play? My blade hungers. Black Guards. Die, organ gunners, die. Frick, you go down already, holy shit. My blade hung Two of them left and they just refused to die. Cold blooded killers. We are ready! I can! I can! There we go. Jeez, crazy. About damn time. Never stood playing as Bretonia, my friend, built the best melee units against Optus' first battle. Well, Bretonia peasants are not good, so you have to play around your ranged advantage and your magic and any cap you might happen to have at that point. Dark elves! You can't just walk in with fucking melee units. Slash kill. Yeah, my arms are fu fucking bad. Witch elves. I right, mean, you go back over here. No mercy. All the Bretonian infantry is fucking bad. It's like Black real bad. <laughs> so, Bretonia is hard to play early, and then it's easy to play late. Dark shots. It's got a pretty, uh, pretty steep curve to it. Rookie four. Cold ones. You gotta remember, men at arms are still just peasants, essentially. Just peasants with a sword. <laughs> Executioners. First, the Bretonian suicide against the forts, now the dwarves turn. Yeah. We will defend Uthwan. Strategic, strategic use of walls. Defend them to death. That's the plan. Can't charge them because most of them are still on the wall yet. Got Dag it. With pleasure. Yeah, so you you need to whatever starting Advancing units you, you begin with as Bretonia, you need to leverage those as much as possible. Because you'll have some good units. Your front line is legitimately just there to die. So your so your archers and whatever good units you happen to have can actually uh, can actually do damage. Then late game, you just have like all cab, fucking grail guardians, grail knights. Massacre them! Let's go around crapping on people. Hippogriff, the royal hippogriff knights. They just freaking are absolutely amazingly good. Like one of the best units in the game. We are ready. No survivors. No survivors. So yeah, the Bretonians just play differently from other factions. It's kind of like the Skaven. All your stuff in the early game sucks, but then late game you just go around destroying people, left, right, and center. So if you try to play Bretonia like the other factions, you're not gonna you're not gonna have much success.
shirtless lady stab the shirtless dwarf man. There we go. Get him. Kill him. Okay, oh, those guys just flew away apparently. All right, just took a bunch of damage and flew away. I require slaves. I do require slaves. I require additional slaves. I can assure you that was not the high elves. Just saying. Well, at least, uh, at least we have the gates. The gates are. Going to probably do some serious work for me once again. At least that'll keep the enemy busy for a while. If nothing else, it'll keep them busy for a while. Freaking wood elves now. A bunch of lizard boys. I'll have to go back and deal with that crap. Ugh. Uh, yeah. That's we will make them bleed. That's just freaking gone. Bye, Torah. Like, oh, he's been destroyed. Those guys are back. So I have to rebuild them as well. How am I doing on supply lines right now? Dropping 23 grand to the ground. That's fine. 75% supply lines. I'm going to be at 100% supply lines here real shortly. Uh. My lady will not allow it. No way. No way. King of the Truki. Okay. What's going on up here? Do not take me for a fool. Freaking Carl and his steam tank army apparently blowing up on me. Alright, cool. Nifty. Not likely. Things have gone from bad to worse arrest. <laughs> I have dark purpose. Alright, show up to handle that situation. <laughs> right. Frickin' hell, Carl. What the... Why? Why tanks? Why these tanks? Why you do this? <laughs> what I ever do to you? I honestly feel like what did I ever do to you is a fair question right now. I literally have done like nothing to Carl, and he just fucking hates me. Well, the Bretonian said that you were an asshole. When can, when have you been able to trust a Bretonian? Ah, uh, all right. Well, I think that's enough of this fiasco for tonight. This is gonna be a really long campaign, guys. Hope you guys, hope everybody's fucking buckled in. We're at turn 266, and so we probably got another like 200 and some turns yet to go. To uh regain control of this nonsense and fight back the waves and waves and waves of enemy armies. Yeah, so it's going to be a while. We're going to be here a while, but for now, for now, 
those all we put? Nah, I still have some of it. We just actually beat a dwarven army away from the gate. But I'm having to pull back off of Uthwan. Like, I'm having to pull my armies off of Uthwan so I can reconsolidate. Have, like, two or three armies in one place and then push through with those armies. Because if I get... I need my armies to support each other. Like, there's just too many bad guys. A single army out here just gets completely swamped when they have, like, four or five armies just roll up on them. And then they, even if they win that fight, another, like, two armies rolls up on them after that. It's too much. It's too much. I can't fight. I can't have one army fight six armies in a single turn. It's just... <laughs> it's too much. So, I'm backing off of Uthwan for the moment. I'm pulling all my forces off. And I'll just try to use the cities to delay for as long as possible. Um... 4 armies of shades. That would be great, except for Petoni would destroy me. Because <laughs> shades are bad against one thing. Cav. <laughs> Petoni has a lot of cav. I need rattling gunners. I need rattling gunners and Giles. Stat. That's what I need. Hoofda. Can I buy... Can I get some on loan from the Skaven for a while, please? Yeah. I don't know if there's any Skaven left on the entire map at this point. I'm pretty sure all the Skaven are dead. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's just Bretonians, Imperials, Dwarves, Lizardmen, and me. I think that's it. Oh, okay, and the Dreadfleet. I got the Wood Elves. That's right, I forgot about the... Yeah, oh, the Wood Elves. Oh, Dreadfleet barely counts, so they don't do anything, they just sit there. Look at all these freaking rogue armies, though. Holy shit. <laughs> yeah, the lizardmen are still doing fairly decently. Well, they're not. Sautekikulu. Tehenowin! <laughs> Fuck this guy. At least TikTok's a pro. Like, he hates me, but. Why is he at war with the last defenders? Why are there just random factions at war with the last defenders? I don't understand. What do they do? Oh, hell, are the... Oh my gosh, are the Tomb Kings dead? Did the fucking Bretonians King destroy Lewin the Lincoln. Tomb Kings? I think to the Bretonians war. might own all of the Tomb King territory, actually. Champion of the Lady. I feel like... Yeah, it looks like it. Bretonia owns all of the desert. They destroy the Tomb Kings. Usually, you can get a friend in the Tomb Kings. But I think they're dead. I think the Bretonians killed them all. Rip. Poor Cetra. We could have we could have made sweet sweet love Cetra, but instead, you got killed by a bunch of by a bunch of dudes on horseback. What happened to your chariots? Oh, mighty lord! Imagine if they build armories and all the settlements, two hundred armor grail guardians. Yeah, that'd be cool. And by that I mean I would I would probably throw my computer out the window. I would just straight up demonstrate my whole computer. <laughs> uh, Cetra's awesome. He has a good campaign. And he's cool. Oh, alright. Alright. It's all this I can take for one night. Plus, it's time, to, time for me to be done anyways. So. <laughs> uh, what the hell is this nonsense? Oh, yeah. Why is my camera completely backwards? We need the face the camera the correct direction button from Three Kingdoms. Oh yeah, Carl's up here with his steam tank army. Yep. What a duder. I have dark purpose. What is this part of? Rookie nobility. Going now. All right, and do I have casters yet? Next question. I have four, four on the sorcerers. At the moment. Now 
I'll get me more sorcerers. Fifteen. Let's get rid of. Yeah, let's get rid of this. Build another sorcerer building over here as well. I guess more money. What's left for this nonsense? So I need to own all Uthwan. I need to construct a dark convent of sorcery, which means I need to own Grand, and they're being assholes and not giving me what I want. And I named three black arcs, which I think I have. I don't know why it's not saying that I do. And then I need eight of these. And then this stuff's done already. Oh no, one of them died. Okay, never mind. Down to two. I should be able to hire another one. Maybe I'll just hire one of the Ziggurat of Dawn. Oh no, wait, I can actually hire Danoth back? I can actually get my injured arcs back, it looks like. These are just upkeep. These cost money as well. Yeah, Danoth. Oh, he shit's level one. Okay. Huh. Alright. Well, yeah, I don't know then. Unless it's the other thing. Unless it's the ones that don't that don't cost. It might be the ones that don't cost, because I have multiple Danoths. Hire another one here. You. Yeah, okay. Yeah, it's the ones that don't have an initial cost. Alright. Makes sense, I guess. Benevolent There. Now we got a bunch of black or black arcs. Yes, black orcs. That's what, that's what we have. Lots of black orcs. Uh, okay, so that's almost done constructing. Malekith, where is Marathi at at the moment? I watch from the shadows. Are there any armies around this area? No, it doesn't look it like it. Okay. Fly, hatred. Let's get back over here and rebuild Coming our army. Get the fuck out of there! Uh, going over to the tablet? Alrighty. Hey, we stopped, man. Good shit. Whoa. This one is capable enough. Man Bane, I guess. Sorceress of Nagaroth. Uh, you. You know who I am. Death to the world. Are you the white dwarf? Might be the white dwarf. Might just. 25% chance. Let's do it. Failure. All right. Well, levels. And it's really cheap to do this because Marathi's uh, agents cost like nothing to use. Dreadlord of the Druki. A vile plan. So roll up here. Striking out. Take that. Success. I right, suppose that guy is level 40. Oh, yeah. That's right, I just, just fought that army. By all. I lost a black guard to them as well. Sucks a bit. Sucks a bit, but I guess it is what it is. Are so many agents all over the freaking place.
I will just critically fail. Don't mind me. No, mannequin. I suppose. Hmm. Nope. King of the Truki. Sailing off. Bounce up in here, I guess. Grab an ambush stance. We'll see if this guy comes north or where the hell he goes. See where he heads off to. My power is yours. Oh, she hasn't moved either. She's crazy. Wait, who? Oh, hang on a second. Traitors do not last. You're one of my. You're one of my actual casters. All powerful. Are you? Whispers of disobedience. Oh, wait, this see. is one of my actual casters. Is this the one that? I have doing agent actions right now, or are they both actual casters? Nope. Okay. Alright, so. My dark heart is yours. A would-be traitor amongst us. Oh no, wait, this is the one I was using for partial agent actions. She just has a lot of equipment on her. Sorceress of bronze. Alright, gonna run back this way. Thought I had another agent as well. Thought I also had a a witch elf personage. Hang on. Everybody still injured? Uh, injured. Or did my witch elf actually fully die? Maybe it's, poten it's potential that she actually just fully died because she didn't have immortality. Yeah, it kind of looks that way. Alright. Alright, so I'll have to get another one. Looks like. Head back over here. Well, head to the water and then head back over there so she can get back into an army. Where's the settlement upgrade? Oh. Huh. I don't really know if that's worth it. There's a bunch of, people, bunch of angry people coming this way. Probably just leave that as it is. Uh, you, though, need to keep building units. Be quick. At 14. Be like two more, I think. I just make a shit little black guard. At this point. To be completely honest. Yeah. I'm gonna go with that, I guess. Got some shades with great swords. As well. Good. Already moved. Scream, sorcerer! She's just chilling. Oh yeah, he was going over here. Start trying to assault Franz. It's gonna be a tall order. Yep. Just straight up critically fail. Sweet. Uh. Spellcast, if I must bandy work. Where else can I build units at? Dark I think I have a lord that's back up as well. Yeah, this guy. Yeah, Beast Binder. Oh, I can only recruit one Black Ark or Lord from each province per turn. Right. Gotcha. Alright, we're going to run the turn, and I'm going to go use the latrine. I will be right back. Thank you guys for watching. I will return it in uh, like, uh, two to five minutes, probably. Burp. Yeah, so we don't even have Death walls here. And carnage awaits. This is not a walled city. Oh, this is a walled city. Never mind. Do I fight it then? Tell 
lot of great swords. And Carl is here, but we might be able to kill some. Yeah, all right, the thrill of battle awaits. Fuck it. If we get one kill on a steam tank or something like that, or some demigriffs or something, it would make it worthwhile. And we are probably just gonna get destroyed, but hey. Carl might also be an flying mount, potentially. Should make life difficult. Attacking from a somewhat intelligent angle. That also sucks for me. That is smart for him. Maid. All right. Uh. How do I? Is it worth my time to be up on top of the wall? Probably just get my freaking shit wrecked. Oh, Carl is over here. Yeah, Carl is on a flying mount. Just hanging out apparently. do here. Guess those steam tanks are gonna ruin me if I'm up on the wall. Corsairs. So we just Eager for battle. chill out inside the city. First which elves. Let's get some the Let's get you people together. And a ranged unit. Let's see if Carl comes this way, I guess. Nagarothi. 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 Let's see what happens with all this nonsense. The steam tanks are just gonna blow up some giant, giant holes in our walls, but hey. But if I could, honestly, if I can tackle Carl with the witch elves, I might be able to hold him down. Or shoot him in the face. Dark Rider crossbows. Eager for battle. Should be the ideal Blood situation. Will flow. Yeah, let's just shoot the gate. Death Where are you going exactly, Bullet. Carl? It shall be. Ceaseless. At once. What are you doing? Questions. Ones that I'm probably not going to get an adequate answer to. Speak, dark deeds. Dark shots. Dark shots. To destruction. Dark elves. On to slaughter. Nagarothi. Destroy. All right. Not get engaged by him here, I guess. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Tackle him. God damn it. There we go. On to violence. Lack. The merciless hooks. Get on top of him. Battle ready. Understood. Let's see if we can't get him preserved here. Massacre them. Witch elves. Come on, witch elves. Preserve him already. God damn it. Dark shards. There we go. We Finally. Unfortunately, we preserved him just as we just as we started retreating. So that's not the best. He is taking a decent amount of damage, though, honestly. Corsairs. Like, it's possible. Retreat! It is possible we take him down. Eager for battle. Onward. Brookie four. He's low. Dark shots. Battle calls. Battle calls. Get him. Three hundred points. Understood. At 
I'm saying destroy onwards to murder. Bringers of death. On to murder. Leader rally. God damn it. Got it with fucking three age, 300 HP. Shots. Eh. Broke gross. Chain. Die, weaklings. Dark riders. Here to have a bunch of great starts running through our front door. Eager for battle. Dark riders. Battle ready. Advance, Steam tanks are just holding back though. Oh, Carl's back. As up, Carl's voice. back. Death hang. I march. Nice berserking. I might actually be able to get him. Down to seven HP. Yeah, he's dead. All right. Dark shots. Advance, Druki. Advance. You're it then. Ow. What are we getting hit by right now? Are those cannons actually like angling over the top of the wall? That's crazy. Some crazy shit right there. Cold-blooded killers. How many great sorts is that? Two? Alright. Pull back! By Drakira! Dark riders! Going! On to slaughter! Move you guys up this way, I guess. Suffering for all. <laughs> Let them despair. I mean, this is not going to do much, but it's better than nothing. Dark Rider crossbows. Murder awake. Attack! Yeah, those freaking steam tanks are Coming angling away. on me really hard. Druki, forward. Forward. Terror. It's a lot of plunging fire coming in. Yes. Oh, Jeebus. Moving up. Die, weakling. Going! No mercy! Good. Kill everything to destruction! Woo. Dark shot! Going! Dark riders! Get in their cab, charge that shit. Forward. I mean, we're doing more than the auto calculator would have Forward. given us, that's for certain. You're it then. Like, we killed Carl, Dealers so that's it's kind of a big deal, honestly. Death hang. Dark shots! By your command! Back! Cold-blooded killers! Run away, Carnage run away, away, run away if you want to survive. But you're probably not going to anyway, so hey. Fuck it. Withdraw! Now everybody's just lost, or apparently our army lost is kicked in or some shit. Alright, well we killed Carl and we, I think we killed a good, a couple great swords as well. Yeah, a couple great swords may have been taken out. Pretty worth honestly. These freaking steam tanks. Some seriously good arcing fire. Apparently. Yeah, Carl and two great sword units. Definitely more than the auto calculator would have given me. Oh, Carrick Zorn is still alive? The Empire and Carrick Zorn are not getting along. <laughs> Ula! I need some Ula right now, shit. I could use a whole bunch of Ula. Be, be very useful at this point. Yes, Clan Septic lost that fight. You know what? I didn't lose that fight. Clan Septic lost that fight. Don't be blaming me. The thrill of battle awaits. Alright, here we go. 